my tribe in peace. How dare you? Oh. I'll take him away and kill him. Slowly. Ah, idiot. Rob, so lovely to meet you. Um, loved the movie and I have to say that your characters are probably my favourite in it. I was mad about the message bird and the commentators when they rocked up near the end totally made it as well. Um, I was wondering, did you, because some of the jokes seemed very Rob Brydon-esque, did you get any contribution to the script or was there improv there? Well, I improvised a little bit but I don't know, I can't remember how much of that ended up in it. I'm, maybe they've used the one or two jokes. things. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You always, you know, when you you, you say so, you you say so much in in these sessions. It's very hard to remember at the end. Well, was that the script or or, or did I just just make that up? We certainly, uh, I improvised a fair bit in the sessions mm. with with uh, Nick, and and it was very that that was re very rewarding to do that because you felt like you were creating with Nick Park, yeah, you know, yeah. whose work I've watched for years and, and admired, yeah. Uh, but I'm glad you liked the characters. Yeah, they were brilliant. And in terms like that, you were saying you were with Nick with the recording. Was there any of the other actors? Because it's such an amazing cast. Uh, did you guys get to record together at any point or was it a solo process? It's very rare in animation to be with the other actor, which I think would surprise people because you'd swear when you're watching it, you think, oh, well, they got a hey, they got this back and forth stuff. Yeah, it's so fast. It's almost always you're on your own. Yeah. Um, so we would do it in a studio and Nick would be there with me in the studio, not behind the glass. And, uh, you know, he'd be chuckling away and he'd say, oh, that was great, that was great. Yeah, but wait, now, now what, if, what if we try it this way? And uh, very exacting, very detailed, yeah, yeah. you know, wanting to explore every, every option. And from my point of view, if I, if I was in there and I would do a line reading that he liked, well, that would be great for me. I go, oh, yeah, you know, that's, yeah. Uh, he, he liked that. And especially if I improvise something that he liked, that yeah. was even more rewarding. Yeah, good reaction from Nick Park. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, it, that's, that's, it's true, because he's, he's a genius. Yeah, he's fantastic. Um, and you're such a good impressionist. Is voice work an area that you really enjoy doing then? Maybe, I mean, not as opposed to other areas, I'm sure you love all your work, but mm. is that an area that would stand out for you? For yeah, that I, you enjoy? I find it easy. I, I've done it for so long. It's how I started. I started in radio, and mm. prior to that, I, I had always impersonated people, and I used to memorize Peter Cook and Dudley Moore sketches and act out both the parts and Peter Sellers things. And so it's the area that I'm perhaps most confident with. Yes. Um, yeah. And as I said, it, it's always come easy. I suppose I've <clears throat> tried to finesse it and, and hone it over the years. Yeah. But essentially, it's just something I can do. Yeah. Like natural someone who's talent. good at football, you know, someone who is, which is not me, someone <laughs> who has a natural rhythm, you know, for me, it's voices. Yeah, yeah. And I read a story recently. Um, I know you grew up in Wales, but you spent a lot of time, well, I don't know how much time you spent with her, but Catherine Zeta-Jones. And I just saw very quickly that um, you stole some money off her. And it was just a quick line I read in an article. Yeah. And I thought maybe you could clarify that story for me. Well, we, <laughs> were, at, story we, for we me. were at the same school. <clears throat> She's younger than me, of course. <clears throat> but we were at the same school. And one day her mum uh, was coming out after dropping her off as I was going, and she said, she said, oh, I've forgotten to give Catherine her dinner money. Ah. Would you give it to her? I said, well, yes, and she gave me the money, and I put it in my pocket, and of course I forgot all about it, and then I was down in town at lunchtime. We used to go down the road, and there was a chip shop, and we had our fish and chips, and then we were coming back. There was a sweet shop. We'd always go in the sweet shop, and I can still remember going in my pocket and going, oh, God, I've got a lot of money on me today. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I bought some sweets and then remembered. So but I didn't know her. I mean, I don't know her. Or, yeah, yeah. Or we weren't chums at school or anything. We just right. happened to be there at the same so time. It's an innocent mistake. Do you ever get to explain it to her personally? No, no, no. I've... Um, I've met her once briefly, but yeah. um, no, we. <laughs> I hope you returned the money when you met her. <laughs> well, with interest, to be quite oh, a lot yeah, now. Yeah. Um, a show of yours that I really loved um, was Gavin and Stacey. Ah. Um, Uncle Bryn is probably one of my all-time favorite TV characters, Thank and you. I love a lot of TV shows. Um, I was wondering, is there any hope at all that we might get um, a comeback from Gavin and Stacey? I know that's not it's down to Ruth Jones and them as well, but would you be interested in bringing it back if the opportunity arose? Well. I would do it if they wanted to do it. Yeah. But I don't especially want to do it. What I'd like to do is have dinner with everyone. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But I, I Christmas like... Christmas dinner, Christmas special? No, another Christmas <laughs> one. I, I like... See, I like the fact that everybody wants it to come back, um, but that we don't. To me, that's kind of perfect, you know? Yeah. Um, 
it, of course, it's, it's James and Ruth. They, they will decide. And if they said they wanted to do one, I wouldn't be the stick in the mud who said, oh, well, I'm not going to do it. I, yeah, I, I, yeah. I would go along with it. But I don't think, I don't, there's, there's no plans. Yeah. They keep on, you know, these rumours keep coming up. I don't know where from, but, yeah. but there, there are no plans. Yeah.